Good day there my fellow Royal fans and welcome to the channel. Today's headline. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle will have made details of their alleged car chase by paparazzi in New York public to send a message to the Home Office about his security. That is the view of Harry's biographer Angela Levin, who reckons he should have avoided the award ceremony if he was worried about photographers. The Duke of Sussex, whose mother, Princess Diana, famously died in a car chase involving photographers, is currently locked in a battle with the UK government over the security he receives when back in the UK. The King's younger son claims his public profile puts his family at risk and the taxpayer should fit the bill. However, UK ministers say his position as a private citizen, having quit as a working royal, means he is no longer eligible. Levin reckons it will suit the Sussex's argument to have details of the chase emerge, even though some have questioned their account. She said, if he has got a big fixation about photographers, and I can understand that because of what happened to his mother, then he shouldn't have gone to the party. He shouldn't have gone. He shouldn't have committed. He wanted the Home Office in the UK to see how dangerous things are and to encourage them to protect him not just in the UK, but also around the world. I mean, that is a silly idea, because he is not working as a royal. Why should we pay for six people a day? It's nonsense. If reports are to be believed, some people saw his security driving badly. They may have been surrounded by press and things, but that doesn't give them the right to drive badly. We have to work out why. And some people have said to me, well, it's because they're very careless in New York. They don't take it so seriously as the UK. I mean, it's a disaster and they have looked so foolish. Everybody's making fun of them. It happened in the same week the couple celebrated their fifth wedding anniversary. Reflecting on that, Levin said, I had the good fortune to be one of the presenters of that wedding and it was so happy. People were so happy for them and the sun shone. We thought she was going to be wonderful and it's just really sad. Look at Harry, now five years on, he looks absolutely shriveled and terrible. A little bit harsh, but do you agree? Leave your comments below, like and subscribe. Goodbye for now.